finally had some sun today and really enjoyed that. Uh, did the uh, squats in uh, increments of 34 and 33, so three sets of the squats for 100 reps, like I did yesterday, and yeah, it just was no problem. Uh, so did, just did a quick time lapse of it. I uh, kept on working on the uh, uh, pull ups and I'm not gonna lie, it's going really slow. I'm kind of trying to figure out a good way to to scale the, the, the pull ups down just to get some reps in, uh, like some, like get a proper volume. Did like a pyramid set today, so th this was the third set. Uh, so I started with one rep, and two reps, then three, and went up to five. And I did that two times. Um, <clears throat> honestly, still just not really feeling a lot of progress in the in the in the pull-ups, but just just gotta keep keep on doing it and, and see. It. Seeing the progress, yeah, just investing for the future, I guess. Also went to a chiropractor uh, after after I was training, so uh, that was quite interesting. Because like I've spoken about before, my, my shoulder, my right shoulder is, has been pretty much uh, lacking stability uh, for the past three years. Uh, so I, I w went to this guy, this Ukrainian chiropractor here in Warsaw, and, and he did some uh, work on my, my on my back. And I mean, it's always tough to to tell like straight after a session if you kind of feel different or not, uh, because obviously you feel different, but. You're not quite sure, you know, like it's hard to know what is like placebo or like because you want to say yes, I feel a lot better, you know. And you want to just, you want the chiropractor to have fixed you, like you have a, a an incentive, you, you're kind of the most biased person in the world when it comes to answering the question like, do you feel better after or not? But I uh, honestly felt felt a little better. I think you know. I want to think, but but we'll see. I'll go back in. I'll, I'll go back to him next week, and he's gonna keep on working on it. And, and I'm definitely willing to give that a chance. You know, just uh, see what happens. He he like seemed like he knew knew what he was doing. Uh, in between the sets here, I'm laying on the bench over over on the other side, and I'm trying to keep my uh, back completely flat to the to the bench, and and, and then just l without kind of arching my back, I'm just trying to put my legs behind the bench, and I feel a, a, a stretch like in the. In the around the hip flexor area and like it there's almost no like my legs aren't going that far behind I'm basically just laying straight down on the bench and, and still feeling a lot a lot of tension when I when I when I do the stretch uh, here, here the park had filled up with young kids they were like doing some crazy stuff you know probably were on like break at school or something and you know, just when playing, it was it was kind of nice seeing them playing around. <clears throat> like some of them were, were quite good as good good at what they were doing. But yeah, I'm, I'm doing the the pull-ups here, and and I mean I don't know the form is not not very good. Like I don't feel like the the uh, like I'm moving straight up and down. It's kind of more like a, I don't know like a roll. So I might have to, to find a better way to do that. Um, yep. 
did some rows and some push-ups as well. Um, I'm not gonna uh, keep it any longer tonight. I'm just gonna finish the video and go, go to bed because I'm taking an early morning train to uh, Krakow tomorrow, going to Auschwitz, uh, Auschwitz Birkenau to uh, see the old concentration camp, and then I'm gonna spend Easter down there in, in so southern south of Poland. So really excited for that. Uh, but yeah, that's it for now. Now for me, I'll, I'll post again tomorrow from the probably from the hotel gym uh, yeah hope you have a good day peace out